Hey, good morning. It's Pastor Pete, as you know. Before I say anything, I want to say hello to my dear friend Beth in Michigan, who I've known since 1980, and uh, she listens to some of these devotionals. So, hey, Beth, you're, you're always dear to me. I'm going to talk a little bit about um, something in Hebrews 4, where it says, Since then, we have a great high priest, talking about Jesus, who's passed through the heavens, Jesus, the Son of God, let us hold fast our confession, our Christian faith. For we do not have a high priest who is unable to sympathize with our weaknesses, but one who in every respect has been tempted as we are, yet without sin. Let us then with confidence draw near to the throne of grace, that we may receive mercy and find grace to help in time of need. Now, I just want to think about this. Sometimes we're afraid... Uh, am I really going to be forgiven? Uh, and you're getting older, and you're starting to cram for finals. You think, oh, I, I was, I've got regrets. There are times in my life when I was doing exactly what God didn't want me to do. I've not always been very faithful. I mean, is there really forgiveness for me who's maybe committed the same sin over and over again? And yes, because the very fact that one of Jesus Christ's offices his office of high priest proves that God forgives you. Now you're familiar his, with his office as king. He's, he's king. He rules over everything. He's king. He's judge. And, you know, if he just was going to punish sin, the king would kick you out of here a long time ago. And, of course, he's got the office of prophet. And he, he, he speaks forth God's word. But God's also it makes sure we understand that Jesus has the office of high priest and what I want you to think about is that the very the de that department is all about pardoning sin. You, if you have a king and a prophet and you don't intend to, uh, to forgive sin, then that's all you need. But that God would create the office of sin pardoning, of forgiveness, that's all that Jesus does. Um, I'm reading this book, The Heart of Christ. Uh, the Heart of Christ in Heaven Towards Sinners on Earth. It's a wonderful book if you can get used to reading the, the 17th century English. But he makes a point here that the fact that Jesus is our high priest gives us confidence that his blood is enough. And it's God's plan to forgive us again and again and again. And if you've committed the same thing 25,422 times, then Jesus will forgive you the next time you've committed it to. Because that's why he has the office of high priest. You don't have to be afraid of your sins biting you later on. You don't have to think that God's going to kick you out or deny you entrance into heaven or that you're somehow damaged goods. Because in Christ, you are fully pardoned and you are righteous in the sight of God. Let that make your day a little bit better. Amen.